Okay, so this is uh, preparation for run three. So this is going to be my third run on Atlas Corp in the game rigged. So as you, oh, first let's uh, OBS can't drag them. I'm in OBS, not Tabletop Simulator. There we go. So remember these cards. These are the cards uh, I drew yesterday. So the two. I don't. How do you grab them separately? There we go. A two of clubs and a six of clubs. Now, what I have decided, and I've spoke to Spencer, who designed this game, and he's playing my game, Wretched. Um, sorry, uh, Weaver, based on the Wretched, by Chris Bissett. Uh, we're going to play um, some additional rules that uh, we produced and is available on itch where you can actually play against each other it's a solo game but you can kind of mess with the fate of the other player that you're playing opposite it against and uh, this game rigged and my game weaver are perfect for that um, because they follow the same kind of storyline they're in the same world uh, they're based around similar events so uh, a bit of synergy there but perfectly possible with other wretched games they don't have to be they can be even separate universes it exists imagine um the gods messing with the lives of mortals well it's a bit like that these extra rules so well it's a bit like poker so you keep your cards instead of discarding them you're gonna i'm gonna try and build a hand um and depending on what hand i get uh, i can launch an attack against Spencer who's playing my game and that might lead to him having to pull extra blocks from the tower or various other events and already I might be on uh, for a flush or maybe even a straight flush uh, possibly if the clubs keep coming so watch out for that I might get to mess with him anyway we roll the dice as always uh, try not to throw it off and a four okay so draw four cards today let's just uh, place no, uh, oh no, wreck the world. There we go. So, one, two, three, four. Okay, let's see what we get. Pick up this first one and flip the three of hearts. So, let's have a look. Three of hearts is, here we go, three of hearts. You found some info on an exec who has been doing unusually dark shit. What is their title, and what did you discover they are up to? Pull from the tower. So, um, because I'm playing opposite Weaver, um, the uh, one of the execs that features in that game is the uh, director of uh, security at Atlas. So I think I'm gonna have to choose that because it'll. Uh, make for for good role play and make more sense so you found some info on an exec who has been doing unusually dark shit what is their title and what did you discover they are up to oh so it's the director of security over at atlas corp and what have they been up to what have i discovered i have discovered that like me they are up to their eyeballs in debt and they are skimming money off the accounts at Atlas Corp perhaps is that dark enough that's maybe not dark enough is it they oh then the reason they're in debt is that they have been sidelining Atlas Corp's Black Ops department so on the surface Atlas Corp is legit and the public love them but any good hacker knows that they're up to some dodgy stuff um, even uh, people disappear um, if you're not careful around Atlas Corp and the dire I've discovered that the director of security is not only the head of that tree that arranges to get rid of people who interfere with Atlas Corp um, but he is also running his own private little missions getting rid of people that he doesn't like nothing to do with Atlas Corp 
um, but obviously these soldiers uh, need paying perhaps and that's how he's going to debt so he's in debt skimming off the surface and that's because he's been running his own missions for his own nefarious purposes okay these cards are glitching a bit what's going on here there we go uh, flip nine of clubs oh I'm getting might be getting my flush let's have a look Nine of clubs. Oh, oh. Nine of clubs. One run left, you're in an extremely difficult situation. Choosing between getting your teammate out safely or getting the money you came for. Which did you choose and do you regret it? Pull from the tower. Oh, I had to pull from the tower for the three of hearts. There we go. Oof. Um what was that nine of clubs one run left you are in an extremely difficult situation choosing between getting your teammate out safely or getting the money you came for what did you choose and do you regret it so I think ah, uh, it's got to be uh, leaving a teammate behind that makes for more of an interesting story doesn't it um, and kind of starts to talk about the kind of person that I am um, an extremely difficult situation so perhaps could it be the person who's been helping me we talked about in the last run about how um, yeah yeah so we talked about in the last run how uh, this person took me under the wing my first run didn't go well the equipment was uh, just not cut out for what I was trying and it got me into trouble um, and this person befriended me but I uh, started me getting into decks I was having to buy equipment off them and they seemed like a friend but they seemed to be manipulating me maybe we do a run together um, and I've seen straight through what they're trying to do with me and when it came to it um, I've left them to get into trouble um, I've taken the money and l left them out to dry hung out to dry uh, they're in trouble um, do I regret it? no because they were manipulating me um, and got me into all this debt in the first place um, the truth maybe they really were my friends um, and were they really manipulating me? don't know and he probably doesn't care, my hacker. Uh, pull from the tower. Uh, uh. There's a loose one. Chicken's way out. Pork until you get a loose one. There we go. Uh, next card. Flip. Ten of hearts. What is going on with these cards today? Uh. Oh, it's because there's a dice. Is it because there's a dice under there? <laughs> Come on, tabletop simulator. You're not a happy bunny today, are you? Ten of hearts. What is ten of hearts? These files are linked to some pretty embarrassing financial records. What do they reveal about an exec at Atlas? And what do you want to do with them? So again, it's got to be the director of security. We already, we already know, um, they are skimming from the top to pay for their black ops. Um, that's embarrassing enough. Um, what else? Um, it shows uh, their expenses, and on the p surface, they look innocent enough, and um, that they've been claiming all these innocent. Uh, uh, all these expenses but hacking a bit deeper um, and tracing what the, uh, what these companies really are and they're just cover stories and he is addicted to drugs and they're actually uh, some kind of black lab that he's been getting weird and wonderful uh, drugs from maybe 
um, to pay uh, to, to ease his nerves um, that the uh, trouble he's getting himself into a uh, black uh, black uh, uh, Atlas Corp yeah so these documents showing that his expenses look quite innocent but I've got evidence if you delve a bit deeper that they're not quite what they seem so that was the ten of hearts and I don't need to pull from the tower for that one and the last one nine of hearts so um, I need to choose some cards here to keep in my deck to attack Spencer nine of hearts shit that's an alarm what did you do to trip it do you hide fight or jack out Oof! pull from the tower what did you do to trip it well let's link it to those documents um, and they're not real it's a trick it's the director of security he's fooled me um, I took the bait these juicy documents to make it look like I had something bad on him and it's uh, triggered an alarm and I'm under attack by um, the security forces at Atlas Corp um, their icebreakers um, sorry my icebreakers have failed and uh, their uh, countermeasures uh, are attacking me do I pull out? No I think uh, it's too dangerous. Uh, if I jack out, it's gonna it's gonna fry my brain. I need to I need to either hide or fight back. Um, and I've been bragging about how good this deck is, how state of the art it, it is. Um, I'm gonna fight back. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's uh, the cards done. Um, so now I just need to choose uh, which cards to keep and I've cheated slightly here because I should have discarded, you only get to keep one so I'll discard the two I think from previously and I will keep the nine from this round so two, I've got two clubs and I'll discard the rest of those um, so that's the prep over I've got nothing I can attack Spencer with yet so uh, we'll call that video there and I'll record the daily log good fun